Happy birthday to you, old flame outside. Hello everyone, Brittany here and welcome back to part 56 of the 100 baby challenge. Now where we left off, Audrey was just about to take a nap before her big birthday. Because today's her birthday, we're at zero. Oh, oh my, we're sparkling. Oh dear, we look like a glass of champagne. Okay, so yes, tonight is Audrey's birthday. I think we have uh, Iris about to prepare the cake. And so, but Audrey's like stupid tired, so she needs, she needs to go to bed. So she didn't take a little nap. And, oh, I'm sorry about the sound in the last part. I tried something different, and it sounded very microphone-y. <laughs> so, uh, I'm sorry about that. That was kind of crappy. Um, and then, oh, oh, our newest addition. Look at our doggy. That I, ooh, whoa, I'm all over the place. That I kept gushing about in the last part, and I will continue to gush, because this is my childhood dog, Molly. And she is our new addition into the house. She's going to liven things up and liven things up. Yes. So let's get going. Okay. So cute, cute. She's just killing me. She's just killing me. I had so many awesome stories in the last part. If you didn't watch it, please do. Um, okay. So I think Audrey, what Audrey? Not Audrey. Uh, Iris was about to make. I wanted to make a hamburger cake because we've never made it before. And I don't think I've ever really made it, period, in The Sims 4. So shame on me. Uh, Alright, our kiddos. We got our son who just aged up uh, like a day or two ago. And he's working on getting his empathy skill up before Monday. And we have Oakley who is close to a birthday. I'm not sure if it'll happen today. And then we have Patricia, who's a little sleepy, and Cora, who's super sleepy and angry about it. But she's asleep, so she's fine. All uh, right. What did you? What did you just do? Did you just sneeze into the cake batter? Well, I guess it's going in the oven. Doesn't matter, right? <laughs> the heat will disinfect your sneeze. Okay, so we got Molly who has an obsession with the fridge. Very cute, very cute. I just love this dog. Oh, she's so great. Uh, makes me want her to have, um, I want, now I want to get another dog and have puppies. So we can have more mollies. Ooh, that'd be so much fun. Anyway, we'll have to see about that because obviously, you know, we have, this is a hundred baby challenge, not a hundred puppies challenge. So maybe I should do one of those. I don't know. Uh, good thing I just cleared up my hard drive because I was running out of space. Okay, so we're going to have Iris just clean up all these plates. we got a lot of plates hanging around. And we're going to set... We're going to set you down to sleep. Yeah, probably should. Read to sleep. Patricia, so we don't have any issues. I don't want any yelling toddlers. Because, you know, they haven't been too bad. They've been pretty well behaved. And, of course, our new baby... Uh, Ryan, who should age up shortly, although I don't remember, um, I haven't gotten any notification about it, but hopefully soon, but, oh joy, another toddler, you know, I'm just thrilled about that, not really. Okay, so what's going on? What, what, what's going on? Oh, are you, jeez, everyone's tired. I'm so tired and I just got up. Uh, yeah, and then, you know, I was gonna have some cereal for breakfast, and the milk is a little bit expired, so I didn't want to, uh, chance that, so I had something else, and I've had it before, and it's awesome, okay, but I was a bit disappointed this time, I don't know, I didn't, I don't feel like it tasted as amazing as it, as I thought it did, I was a bit disappointed with my breakfast. So I'm thinking about maybe eating some leftover pizza. I should just have that instead. Oh, 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 the baby is crying. It woke Audrey up. Don't be sad, Audrey. I know it's your birthday, but look at all your wonderful kids and your new house. You should be thankful. It's not the 
number, it's how you feel, right? Is that is that is that what we're going by? Okay, so ooh, her sadness is wearing off. Is that cause Molly's here? Cause oh look! See, I love this. She just engages with people. She just I love it. I just love it. Alright. So it is time. Why don't we add the candles and we'll have Iris come over here. What now? I told you to get going. Did you? Oh, she did it, guys. All right, well, stack. <laughs> and then we'll read you to bed soon. Okay, it is time, everyone, for Audrey to become an adult. Well, go look at her. She's just like a copy of her. Jeez. Okay, so are you ready? Happy birthday to you. Old flame outside. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Audrey. Happy birthday to you. And many more. Figure it out. <gasps> My visa. <laughs> Come on, girl, blow. Use them old lungs. Okay, Audrey aged up. Uh, adulthood, fulfilling dreams, planning for retirement, and midlife crises await. Oh, oh dear. The perfect time to start wrapping up those lifelong goals and being pregnant about 20 more times. Oh, our dead daughter has sent us a gift. How wonderful of her. And Michelle, who is our only other child in the neighborhood. Okay, and now, um, so let's see. I see, I see some... They added, um, I, I, used, I thought there used to be, like, no difference between young adulthood and adulthood in this game, but they added, like, you know, like, like, some smile line things, and then I think maybe around the eyes just to make you look a tad bit older, but, you know, if you use some lotion or maybe some, you know, highlighter, well, not highlighter, um, get some, uh, concealer and just conceal under those eyes, girl. You get them dark circles to go away. Uh, get some stuff, some... Get yourself some tart shape tape. There you go. All right, so we're gonna put away this cake because no, no one's really awake to eat it, and she can't eat it. Well, our son could eat it. Whatever, doesn't matter. Let's save it for later. All right, so Audrey is older, but that doesn't stop her from having fun and being pregnant a lot. Okay, so we need to find our next victim. Okay, our latest victim. Let me get my notes here. Um, flippy flippy was Damien, obviously, uh, duh, because we just had, um, we just had Ryan. So I was looking at, you know, Sergio, he's pretty cute. Gavin, Jared, Federigo, uh, maybe Bob. You know, we can be a, a homewrecker again. Um, I don't know who this dude is. He's creeping me out. Uh, we got Mitchell, Paolo, uh, we got a lot of people on our radar. So I'm thinking, let's get a townie because I really didn't, um, get to know a lot of the townies last time and they kind of croaked on me. Um, so let's see if Sergio would like to do something. Uh, looks like Iris is cheering up. We have some gardening to do, so get on it, girl. You, oh, excuse me, are still doing okay. You, oh, excuse me, are getting a little sleepy. Let's see. I agree, Audrey. It's a great day. Let's go out and enjoy the day. Okay. Let's go. Let's get out on the town because we rarely do. Just like me. I'm just kidding. I get out every once in a while, but you know, I, I, I value my me time. I do. All right, so we are here. It is nighttime. Hello, oh. gorgeous. Do you like older women? I'm just kidding. Okay, so hi. How you doing? So what are we gonna do here? You got something? Uh... Oh, I don't know if I want to finish that sentence. I don't know where I was going with it. I have no idea. No idea. We're just gonna, you know, chat them up, compliment, what do you do, what do you like, what are your hobbies. My hobby is flirting with younger men. Yay! 
hey, my, you know, you know, in real life, not, not talking about Audrey, my husband is younger than me, but he's only like less than two years younger, so it's not like a huge gap or anything, but, um, people always, okay, I know you're a young stud, okay, you don't have to prove it to me, I'm good. Are you done now? <laughs> Oh, hey, Mortimer, how you doing? You don't remember us, but we did have your kids, and one of them died. But you weren't around for that. How dare you? Okay, anyway. Uh, all right, let's just, you know, use, I love that boast about family interaction, so we can, ooh, we can do this about cake. Oh, I like it. Let's find, I know he doesn't like kids, but she has that thing that she just learned that. So she should already know. Yeah, she knows. He hates kids. Oh, Lord. Well, you're about to have some. <laughs> well, not yet. Unfortunately, it's going to take a little time. Which is why I'm trying to... Oh, uh, uh, what? What? You... Mm. How rude. We're having a pleasant conversation, and he just literally vanishes on us. Oh, dear. We got ghosts flying around. Okay, so that was, um, well, it wasn't quite a date, but, that's not what I meant to do. Um, well, that was awkward. Didn't, no, it didn't turn out as exciting as I was hoping it was going to be. I was hoping for a little, you know, flirty fun to happen, but I think it's not. So, we'll go back home to all of our screaming toddlers who aren't that screamy. I should, I should, I stand corrected. They've been very well behaved. Until, the, oh dear. Are they all up? Oh lord. I'm, oh, 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 what now? I've been trying to do homework for school, but the last assignments have been, have felt really hard. Maybe I'm not smart enough to do it. What do you think? Spend more time. Practice makes perfect. You'll be fine. All right. Now all of our girls are up and wandering around. You need to go potty. So do that. So do you. And so do you. The trifecta of potties. Please go to the bathroom. You're tired. So um, I'll go paint. You haven't painted in a while. And I should get another easel. You need to go potty, so please go. What's Molly doing? She's eating. Where is Iris? Oh, why? <laughs> you just got over your sadness from Wolfie passing. And now, now, oh, oh, see. Okay, it's almost Ryan's birthday. Okay. So tomorrow, this time, we'll have another toddler. But like I said, you just got over our loss from our, our wolfy loss and now you're mourning over your sister see this is why I'm not saying you shouldn't mourn over her but I just hate the random crap that sims do when you leave the house without them I don't like it all right I guess you're having breakfast for dinner which I'm all for you know like pancakes has anyone had pancakes for dinner because it's great all right, go here. Audrey maybe needs to not paint right now because her toddlers are... Yeah, oh, I shouldn't have done that. Um, They need attention and Iris is a sad glum or a sad lump. Uh, so give... Who is who is that? Uh, Patricia. Give Patricia a bath. And she needs one too, but we'll have her um, do a little babbling with Blarfy. We need food out, otherwise you can't eat. That's a novel thought, isn't it? Alright, grab some chow. You don't need a bath, but you sure as heck do need attention. Okay, so you're giving her a bath, you're watering all the plants, we can evolve one of them. Just one, most of them are pretty good, but, um, you know, she should probably spray those too before they get into a bad mood. I don't, we don't want our plants in a bad mood, everybody. Plants have feelings too, you know. It's true. Alright, so how's Patricia? She's good. I want to keep her up for a little bit. 
<laughs> Maybe so that she can eat before bed? I don't know. I suppose it wouldn't hurt. She'll be hungry soon, right? Alright, go and play with a toy. And you... Still have a lot of energy, so why don't you just play? Why not? Who else needs a bath? Uh, Cora. So give a bath to Cora. What are you angry about? Oh, you're not angry. You're tired. I was thought she was stomping about. Stomping about. There we go. Who's this? Oh, Joaquin. What's up, Joaquin? You want to have kids with us? Oh, he's kind of cute, guys. I feel like we should, like, ditch our child and go meet him. <laughs> Which I'm totally gonna do. Okay, if he stops walking, we'll see. Oh, he did. Oh, he did. Ooh, okay, Iris. So you stop what you're doing. And since Audrey's being a neglectful mother, why don't you give Cora a bath? Because she needs one. Um, Oakley needs attention still. Why don't you... Well, she's about to do that. Um... Who's Patricia? Stop what you're doing. And go hug your sister. Don't know why I'm saying that. But I... Oh, you could... Oh! Oh, here! Go pet the doggy! Go pet... Molly, where are you going? Molly! Goofy dog? She's running amok. Okay, so Joaquin is goofball, outgoing, and a music lover. Pretty, pretty good. So we're just going to chat it up, get to know him a little bit. I think we know what he does for a living because he's, the, I think he's the DJ. I think you see him at the club a lot. But Audrey doesn't go to the club, so I don't even know if she knows what a club is. <laughs> All right, where are you at? What are you doing? You're tired. Oh, you're tired. Why don't you just eat? Just eat something. I'm sure by the time you sit down, your hunger will be yellow. Um, there's Molly. She's waiting for the toddler. Oh, you jerk. All right, why don't you just go to sleep? You're tired. Just call it a night. So cute! That's so adorable! Oh my god, that's precious! I love it! But that's like, how's that not giving her attention? That's lame. Stop. Hammer time. Why don't you give your daughter some attention? Because petting the dog is doing it. <laughs> Okay, and then why don't you read her to bed? That's Oakley. Read Oakley to bed. The baby's crying. Uh, you need some fun, but oh man, you're hungry too. So just go here. You're eating. You're better. You can read her to sleep, I hope. How come interacting with a pet does not fulfill social? You think it would? I think it would. I think it should. What is going on there? Are you going to pick up your daughter? Or? Yeah, I don't know what went on there. Okay. Um, you are tired, so why don't you go to sleep? I got that light on now, so we won't... Aw, oh, Molly's sleeping. I love how she just ran in here and went, I'm done. Just, just plop down. She can't. She, she lost all her energy. She's depleted. All right. Why don't we read? Is that Cora? Yeah. Read Cora to sleep, and then Patricia will be next. Have her go there. Oh, I was having an issue with the beds in the last part where they have to be on a certain side to read these freaking kids to bed and it drives me nuts so i flip some of the beds around i hope okay good it's not an issue i don't want any issues you know what we should do we should get molly a bed because we have a you know they're not expensive i don't think and we love molly um, it doesn't mean we still love Wolfie, but I don't think we had money for a bit. 
I wish she could sleep on the couch, honestly. That's classic Molly right there. She would always sleep on the couch. So I'll just leave it for now. Um, okay. You need to eat a few of these. And maybe we should harvest the plants, get some more money. I'm deathly afraid of the bills. Oh my god, guys, Lacey. Lacey's back and she's very sad. And she's sleeping in... Oh, she's hiding under the covers because she's sad. <laughs> and she's gotten Molly's attention. And she's up. And she's up. Don't break my stuff. Oh, dear. Oh, this isn't good. I'm like cringing because I'm afraid of what she's about to break. <laughs> All right, well, we'll have her go to the bathroom anyway, because, you know, why not? Your daughter's not haunting the shower. Pfft. Pfft. What do we know? Okay, so everyone is a sleepy sleep sleep, which is great. Oh, she's heartbroken. Iris, talk to your sister. Go cheer up. We don't need any angry ghosties in here. Sure, bring up an embarrassing child at the moment. Maybe she'll turn yellow and get mad at us for it. <laughs> oh, look at that. She's got the calm emotions. Huh. Oh, but she made Iris happy. Yay. Is she gonna play? <laughs> oh. I'm just joking around. Okay. Um, alright. You, God, you're hungry too. You just can't win right now, can you? Uh, I'm just gonna have her go to sleep. I really can't. I really don't have the energy. Alright, get to know. Tell a funny story. We just want to keep her happy and entertained so that she doesn't break anything. You know, maybe she'll take care of the baby. Who knows? Who knows? But I guess we will find out next time because I'm going to leave. That's right, I'm heading out. Mm -hmm. Well, not really. Just, you know. You know. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I did. Um, and if you did, please subscribe. Because that would mean the world to me. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.